Hello, thank you for taking a moment to watch this video. And on this training, we're gonna be talking about checkbox fields. You may have fields within your Zoho account that are configured as checkbox fields. Here you can see I've got a couple of them, sample checkbox, and then I've got custom checkbox on contact. One of them is checked and one of them is not checked. Let's go ahead and start a dial session. Let's talk about how this data is managed between phone burner and Zoho. So here you can see we're calling our good buddy Kyle. Let's go ahead and end this call. And if we scroll through the custom fields that were created in phone burner, we'll see our sample checkbox. That one is currently checked and that matches what we see in Zoho. And then our other one is a custom checkbox on contact. Let's go ahead and scroll down. Here it is, custom checkbox on contact, and it is unchecked, matching what we see back in Zoho. So this is the nice thing about checkboxes. The system will automatically set it to a checkbox even if it does not have any data in it the first time you begin a dial session. And it'll allow you to check and uncheck those boxes as you're going from one call to the next. So let's go ahead and reverse these. Sample checkbox is unchecked. Custom checkbox is now checked. We're gonna go ahead and mark this contact as interested. And we are done. Now let's go back to Zoho. Let's refresh this record. You'll see custom checkbox on contact is now checked. And sample checkbox is unchecked. And that's it, that's a quick little overview of how the checkbox field flows between Zoho and Phone Burner. Thanks for watching this video and happy dialing.